TFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN, 10 a.m. Eastern Time on Thursday, 30 minutes into the trading day. And we got all the markets in the red right now. We get the S&Ps. You're down 19 points, trading at 44.52. Tech stocks lower. We get the NASDAQ 100 negative by 95 points. We have the Dow off 119 points. All the markets catching a little bit of a bid at 930 on the opening bell. And then the sell off began the Russell negative by 11 points right now. This all on the heels. And we got retail sales and we got initial jobless claims. So let's jump over to those in a moment uh, right now before we jump over to some of the other indices. Uh, retail sales, an increase of 0.7% for the month of August. The market had been looking for a decline of 0.7%. If you exclude, okay, let me get that. Yes, excluding autos, which was a decrease of three something percent, sales actually advanced 1.8% in August, the largest gain in five months. So that comes out at 830. We also get initial jobless claims. Uh, that number coming in at 332,000, a slight uptick from the 312,000 that we got the previous week, which had been a pandemic area low. So those are the two economic numbers out there at 830. The market actually take those and trade higher. There's some context for the chart for you. We spike higher on the open as well. And just like that, we've given up 25 S&P points from the higher price that we were at in that market. The NASDAQ 100 catches a bid on the 830 number slightly. There's your 830 number. We actually open and spike above that price point to 15,472, and we've given up about 100 points from there. Commodities, you got gold moving to the downside. How about down $45 at 1750, quite a day for gold. Crude, a little bit of negative action, still pretty healthy, sitting at 7192, right near $72. And notes and bonds, we're getting some lower price and higher yield right now. You have the 10 year, you are down 12 ticks at 13305. That's putting the 10 year at 1.343%. Let's see if how some of the banks are trading. There they are. Uh, probably one of the few sectors in the positive with rising yields. We got the JP Morgan up three quarters of percent. We got Bank of America up 1.1% today. We jumped to some of the FANG stocks. Amazon down seven tenths. Microsoft down eight tenths. Apple shares down eight tenths percent as well. Stay tuned, folks. We got Fast Market coming up live at 11 o'clock. Kevin Hanks, Alex Coffey, they're gonna be talking about Target. They're gonna be talking about Walmart today, among any many others. Larry Pesvento live at noon. Steve Rhodes, Dave White, Tom O'Brien, all this afternoon. Stay tuned, folks. We'll be right back. The reality 